It's a beautiful morning on the Guilford Green. We want to show you a beautiful spot and location you can visit just down the street from here. Take a look. Formidable and stately in appearance, the Henry Whitfield State Museum in Guilford is a sight to behold. Built in 1639, it stands as the oldest home in Connecticut and the oldest stone house in New England. It's very unique because the English settlers didn't usually build out of stone. Michael McBride is curator of the museum that was once the home of Reverend Henry Whitfield, Guilford's founding father. Well, Henry was a Puritan minister uh, who led a group of about 350 people here. They were coming for religious freedom like most of the settlements in New England. And like their freedom, they took their security very seriously. The stone home served as a virtual fortress. The Whitfield House is actually one of four houses like this that the first settlers built to help protect the community. Yeah, you could kind of look at it as uh, the three little pigs kind of concept. Step inside the 3,000 square foot building and it's like stepping back in time. Well, when people come to visit, they're walking through the space that existed back uh, in the 1640s. The front hall features a huge stone fireplace that serves as a centerpiece for the home and life four centuries ago. Strong, thick walls surround you built to repel invaders. It was totally sealed up and people were, had created this legend. You know, oh, there was a window that viewed the harbor and then in the 30s when our architect ripped everything off, he found it. The artifacts inside just as valuable for piecing together the past from the 17th to 19th century furniture that decorates the home. Most of the pieces are Connecticut pieces since we started out as the State Museum. And it's the uh, tower clock from the second and later the third meeting house in Guilford. Extremely important because it's the first tower clock made here in the colonies. But this visual tour just scratches the surface as to what the Whitfield Museum really has to offer. It's something that we try to get across to all of our visitors is that um, the human element, no matter what the uniqueness of a building or a site or an event is, that the human element is really something that you can really um, relate to.